We're watching um, Hunter x Hunter, I guess it's over. Uh, My Hero Academia. Um, I'm kind of caught up on that. I'm not, I'm sort of starting to lose steam on that. When I start losing steam on an anime and I don't completely watch episodes or I don't go back and rewatch stuff I made, so I'll just keep watching the new ones. That kind of happens on the story, it's a little weird to me. I don't like a bunch of zigzag stories. I like um, a hero who's constantly leveling up. I don't really like when you do detours or like, I don't know, any parallel moves <laughs> in the anime world are not for me. I don't like parallel moves. I want him, I want the hero moving up and forward at all times. I don't know, I keep checking to see if there's anything weird behind me. I'm going to rock. They're going to be looking out. There's a bottle of water. There I go. I'm like, why do you have a bottle of water on your floor? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> One, that's not every on. Two. Hmm. I'm gonna eat all this. Seven days of the week. I got ways we can eat. Counting ways on the beach. Learning names we can meet. I'm booked. I'm booked. I'm booked. Got some yellow rice, some beans, some chicken, some plantain, and then a jalapeno popper from H-E-B, which I'm excited for. To get a close-up. So yeah, this is what Dan Danielle made yesterday. I'll do a carousel shot for you. These beans, she, um, she is really good at making both beans and greens. It's like a southern thing. Um, but she, she put turkey wings in them. Uh, the chicken she made on the stove top was so good. And then the plantain. I actually made these plantains this morning. But she also had a plantain yesterday. But we ate all of them. So I made these plantains just now. Fried them. I love plantains. My mom got us some plantains. So, uh, oh. Let me pray. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for this food. I pray that you bless it, help it to nourish uh, my body, Lord God. Bless the source from which it came, and also help us provide, Lord God, for those who do not have. Thank you so much. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Let's do this. Let's do this. Mm -hmm. I was waiting on these. I was waiting on this. It's so good. But, um, Still early in the mukbang thing. So, I'm going to talk about something unrelated to mukbang culture on YouTube. I'm going to talk about. I don't know what I'm talking about. This food is really good though. Um, Danielle's awesome. And yes, you know what? I don't know if the color's kind of like an ensemble plate. I'm shaking the whole thing. What do you call this? Oh, a chicken rice. Ooh, I'll take this back. A chicken rice, a chicken rice plantain plate.
See on one of my Japanese show. Oh, that you also think about watching some animes. Um, while I do my things. I like anime. For those who don't know. I love Japan. For those who don't know. I love anime. For those who don't know. And uh I talk about anime. What anime do you guys watching? I'm watching. Um my bye Boku wa yarimas I wanna write a song in Japanese my bye Boku wa yarimas I wanna All right um Doctor Who just came back on which is super cool It's not an anime but it's just a TV show sci-fi show Um so I saw the first three episodes of the new season of that super cool Rick and Morty came back that is cool. I'm caught up on that. I complain about not having time, but I'm actually caught up on a lot of TV shows. So, I don't know what that means. But, um, um anyways, I'm watching um, Hunter x Hunter. I guess it's over. I don't know. My Hero Academia. Um, I'm kind of caught up on that. I'm not. I'm sort of starting to lose steam on that. When I start losing the steam on an anime, I don't completely watch episodes or I don't go back and rewatch stuff I made, so I'll just keep watching the new ones. That kind of happens on the story, it's a little weird to me. I don't like a bunch of zigzag stories. I like um, a hero who's constantly leveling up. I don't really like when you do detours or like, I don't know, any parallel moves <laughs> in the anime world are not for me. I don't like parallel moves. I want him, I want the hero moving up and forward at all times. I don't know, I keep checking to see if there's anything weird behind me. I'm going to walk off. They're going to be looking up. There's a bottle of water. All right, I'll I'm like, why do you have a bottle of water on your floor? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> One, that's not every on. Two. Hmm. I'm gonna eat all this. I know what you guys are thinking. Oh, that's why. You're not losing weight. Even though you work out every now and then. What's about? Yes, you're correct. There is no mystery here. Not for me, anyway. For other people, there may be. But, uh, I like them. But, I've been, you know what, I've been eating like one or two of these size things uh, a day. It's funny, like, when you just start doing something like a day ago and then you pretend like it's a diet that you're on here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm also on this, uh, this, uh, I've been doing keto for a minute. Like, sir, you just had one keto snack. You have not been doing keto for a minute. Yes. Isn't one keto snack doing keto? Back off. So for two days, I need two of these a day. And I'm gonna walk on the dog, thanks to the dog cage. So, and I'm having more time, you know, in my personal life. Getting some things settled. By the grace of the Lord. since I was a kid. It's all sad to see the last plantain go. 
You want to eat them first, but you also want to eat them last. You also want to eat them in the middle. Just like the marshmallows and Lucky Charms. Plantain are the... I didn't even really need... You know what? I, I think sometimes you think about plantain because like sweet as like a dessert when it comes to dinner, but... It's really just part of it. That's what's so good about plantains. Like, this is part of my dinner? What? This is a banana. More delicious than a banana, though. Anyway, back there, anyway. I didn't bring you all. One second. Sponsorship right there. Sponsored by uh, Walmart, great value. Both are great, both are great value. Okay. I should have myself sponsored by. I should just use a Walmart affiliate link for all my sponsorships because I, I made one of those recently and I was like, well, I'm not going to use a Walmart affiliate link, but I should just do all my things are sponsored by Walmart. Click the link below. <laughs> I'm just showing you. I'm sort of joking, actually. If I can find the link easily enough, then really quickly, well, I'll put a Walmart affiliate link. Also, if you're in San Antonio, um, my, well, my, my company does a lot of stuff. So, click that link below, too. Anyway, we're talking about anime. So the anime that I am currently watching, um, what did I just finish? The only thing I check up on now, Doctor Stone, I think just kind of finished, and then I kind of did. I'm not really checking up on anything else. I watched a few episodes of Fire Force. Um, that was good. But yeah, um, that's what else I'm watching. Um, I have a country world subscription, it would buy, but it's only six ninety nine a month, so. I'll go on whatever's up there, but I'm not really watching anything else on anime, so that's the kind of it. If you guys have any uh, any ideas of stuff you're watching, go ahead and let me know. Carlos then, because I'm Nigerian. Nigerian, we don't play. Anyway, this is enough for it. <coughs> My first meal of the day, which is also lunch. Let's go, let's go, let's go too. Hopefully I'll think of different things to talk about. I wonder if people like to make notes or stuff to talk about. Um, I'll probably just keep talking about animator. What's going on in the world? You know, I haven't been watching the news lately because there's too much stuff going on. And not enough of it is getting kind of reported in a way that it may be kind of interesting to me. If I go to CNN, it's like, 
Trump, Trump, Trump. I'm like, I know that it's Trump. I, give me a, there should be a specific section for Trump stuff. Because you can't just take over all regular news forever with Trump. That's ridiculous. So, apparently watching the news. It just makes you feel weird. I feel like I'm only following Trump on Instagram or something like that. <laughs> That's what it's like going on CNN. CNN is like if you're just following Trump on Instagram. Can I say we're talking about anything? Get back to it. It was like, well, you're really eating that chicken. You must be hungry. You must be broke. And there's more chicken in the kitchen. What are you saying? I'm not broke. And these are some of the best pockets of chicken right here. And get down to, to the real bone. I'm not even doing this one real justice. I'm just giving it a casual clean. Casual, neatly clean. <coughs> Digging shops. Hmm. That's what I just started going full, full rough on the guy. Spring out the toothpick at the table. I said, hey, that was good. Ah, let me get this, this pork rice for my kid. That doesn't make sense. Why would pork rinds stick in the teeth? Also, I don't think Africans really eat pork rinds like that. There is a new African restaurant in my city. I wonder, like, that should be an easier way to browse restaurants by like, African restaurants, Chinese restaurants, like all over the globe. See how they're compared to each other. Whoa, did I just come up with a new idea for the website? Steal it. I don't have time for it. I'm doing something similar to that, you know, with all the um, districts and stuff that I do over at Project Forward. In him. Um, but anyway, done eating this for today. As far as what's going on in my regular life today is Wednesday, so I just get to work on a bunch of stuff today. Website design, video editing. I've been kind of jealous lately when I do video editing. I'm like, you know what? I'm out here ed editing video. People are performing. I wish I was performing right now, and I do want to perform more, so I'm not like dismissing that, but at the same time, so when I'm performing, they're sitting down somewhere. You know, why think about what's going on in other people's lives? And it's just, you know, it's, it's so angsty. I'm out of my 20, 20s now, so I, I, don't, I can't even justifiably be angsty anymore. I have to be an adult. And uh, I mean, for some time, really. You know, some people have to be an adult in my 50s, so <clears throat> that's not really what I mean. I more mean on this trajectory of, and I'm not really talking about like on real levels, because on a real, real level, I'm just grateful. I'm grateful for food, I'm grateful for, for air, I'm grateful to, to be able to breathe, I'm grateful for everything. You know, thank you, God, for every little thing. I'm grateful for this sweater. It's cozy. Oh, it's so cozy. You know, I'm just grateful. Um, but on the uh, ambitious level, um, that ambitious level, like, and, and ambitions can, t and it, ambitions completely, you know, have full reign over your emotions and everything like that, because you get into it. It's like you wouldn't, even if you're playing a video game, you get into it. People are like slamming down controllers. It's really super fake. Super fake. You're literally just watching a video. Anyway. Um, so, you know, and ambitions will take you all over the place. And right now, my ambitions, you know, they're, they're always like charging me up to either want to do this more, want to do that more, not want to do this, not want to do that, want to do this, want to do that. And uh, it's up to me to do all that and survive safely and care about the things that matter to me. Because no one else is going to care about those things. How can they? You know, stuff that's just you. Anyway, I'm not gonna try to turn this into a motivational stuff. I'll try to motivate myself this morning to go for a run. I feel like 
for every five minutes of motivational speech you tell, you should have to go around, or else you're actually, you're not really generating energy. You're not really motivating yourself. If you can't motivate yourself to run, but some people will be like, I run 10 miles a day, so I can be, I'm not making any sense right now, so I'm gonna go ahead and stop that topic. <clears throat> Anyway, uh, thank you for watching the Kenya Mukbang show. If you guys had fun, um, I'm going to go get to my day. If you get to yours, please like, subscribe, comment, and share. And uh, check back. I've done some other mukbangs. This is my first mukbang, like my fifth one or something like that. So check the other ones and, and check out the new ones. Hopefully, I'll give you one meal a day. I eat like three.